Hooke's law. Hooke's law in elasticity. It's very very important for chapter point of view. Sometimes for board level exams, it's two marks type or one mark type question comes. What is Hooke's law? Look, Hooke's law. It states that within elastic limit, within elastic limit, 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 stress is proportional to corresponding strain. Great. Stress is proportional to corresponding, corresponding strain. strain. Look, students. Uh, in other words, we say that uh, stress is proportional to strain. And we remove the proportionality sign. We introduce a constant that is E. So stress is equal to E times strain, where E is called modulus of elasticity. If we plot a graph, stress is proportional to strain. If we plot a graph. Stress is proportional to strain. strain, right? Now look here. There are three types of stress. Correspondingly, there are three types of strain. Yes. So types of elastic modulus E. There are three types of E, corresponding to three types of strains, yes. which are further corresponding to three types of stress. Yes. First, Young's Modulus. Which modulus? Young's yeah, modulus. That is stress is proportional to longitudinal strain. Which stress? Tensile stress. Which stress? Tensile. Or we say Stress is y times strain. Which strain? Longitudinal. The y is what? Stress upon strain. If there is a wire, we apply a force F on the area of cross section A. So what is y? Stress F upon A, there is an increase in length by delta L. So this is delta L upon L. So y is equal to F L upon A delta L. This is which modulus? This is Young's modulus. Young's modulus. Which modulus it is? Young's modulus. Young's modulus. And second, bulk modulus. Students, bulk modulus is represented by K or B, right? There is a volume V. We increase its volume by delta V. What is bulk modulus? That is K or B. That is which stress? Volumetric stress. That is F upon A upon delta v upon v so k is f v upon a, a delta v. the unit of k is same as that of stress because delta v upon v is dimension less unit of y is same as that of stress because delta l upon l is dimension less students the third modulus is called modulus of rigidity that i will explain you in the next video right hope it is clear yes sir Noted.